This is how to kill your morning glory. I was told it couldn't be done. I went to IFA and talked to a man there and he said, oh, get this one product. And I never did, I left. And then I came back and then there was a manager that says, no, don't use that one. Definitely use this one. He's had neighbors or customers come back to him to tell him that it even killed the morning glory in their neighbor's lawn. So if you live right next door to somebody else and their morning glory is connected to yours, so it will kill it. Um, I realized though, I did a minimum uh, dosage to uh, the first time I applied it and just, just because I was worried about how strong it was. So I recommend doing the maximum one if you have a lot of morning glory. Um, but if you need to be cautious, then do it that way. So I'm giving you the maximum um, recommended instructions. Uh, so what you'll need, here's morning glory. This was in our pasture, not in our lawn. So I did spray once and it was able to kill a lot of it, but I realized I need to go over it again. So what you'll need is, um, you can use a two gallon sprayer. That's what I used. You'll want to use the medium to coarse spray. Uh, definitely. I also did a fine spray, so it could be why mine didn't work so well. You'll want the Four Speed XT, this is what kills it. Selective herbicide. Uh, definitely read the directions because there's a lot how to clean the container, all that stuff after you're done before you dispose of it. And then this is IFA's brand called Excel. It actually opens the pores, I guess, of the plant if they have pores. And this is, it, it, wor it works to excel the performance of herbicides, fungicides, insecticides, and fertilizer. So you'll want to get both, especially with morning glory, because it's really hard to get rid of. And then a measuring spoon, that's a tablespoon. You'll want some glasses and gloves so you don't poison yourself. So you just fill this two gallon sprayer. This is just one of the Roundup ones, but you can buy a no name one that's empty, you know. Um, and you mix two gallons of water with four tablespoons of the Excel and two tablespoons of the Four Speed XT per two gallons of water. And just spray it on. It does have guidelines as far as the temperature outside and if you're watering your lawn every day, you might need to do this a few times to get rid of it because I think it's gonna just dilute it. Um, so here's what you need to buy. Four Speed XT, Selective Herbicide, IFA Excel, Accelerator Performance, a two gallon sprayer if you don't have one, and gloves. Um, another thing I thought of that might work even faster because a sprayer takes forever you have to keep pumping it you got to make sure you release the pressure before you open it again so it's kind of scary so maybe mix the stuff first and then use something like this this is a bug spray thing they make it for lots of different stuff those kind of containers they'll use for uh, washing cars or whatever so I'm thinking I might just pour it in there and spray it all over the the lawn but it will be diluted with the hose so I got to figure out how that would even work but anyway that's what you do and I'll show you the morning glory that I have used it on and this has been a oh, maybe two weeks now so this is working I don't know if you can even see what it is anymore but I don't have the flowers popping up. But it's starting to shrivel and go brown. So it's working on it. It didn't kill my lawn. I do have other problems like crabgrass or whatever this stuff is. So I gotta use something else for that because it doesn't work for that. It does work for other, other uh, noxious weeds and stuff. So you'll just have to read the directions. But anyway, there you go. Four Speed XT, IFA Excel, and you're good to go.